right you lovely lot and a big warm welcome to anybody new joining my channel today and if nail art is right up your street then please consider subscribing guys we're on day 18 of nail art christmas can you believe it because i sure as heck can't i started this like just over a week ago and i've got three videos left to make it's great and I'm only still in August I know for those of you that haven't caught it on another video um, I booked to go away for Christmas my parents live abroad and we're going to be away for majority of December so I thought I would start early and get nail art Christmas out of the way bringing you a nail art video short and sweet for the first 21 days of December because I do realise that you guys get super busy and you just don't have time. Now let's talk design. I'm going to do a candy cane today so I've done a really big chunky one with big chunky stripes. I've done, I've done them in the past with small stripes so I wanted to do it a little bit different so I've drawn it in shaded in the white particles of this candy cane and then today we're going to do it green I am using nail chemis artisan gel paint the link for those are below for those of you that are interested and I've used them for all of this video the green the white and the red bow that we're going to pop on there later I am fully curing in between so I draw the the candy cane shape fully cure that that will give me the lines then to colour in with the white gel paint now I'm coming in with the red I'm going to do the centre part of this bow I am going to make this really really easy I'm not going to shade it and put dark and light and things like that I have done that in the past but I'm I'm very conscious that the nearer we get to Christmas the less time nail techs have to do nail art designs you know you want to get your customers in everybody's trying to get in as near to christmas as possible i know been there done that got the t-shirt so that's why i'm trying to make them simple quick and easy so i have drawn the little square in the middle and then done two arch lines off the edge of the nail and colored that in with the gel paint i'm just rounding off that edge a little bit more there then i'll do the other side exactly the same way before popping in the lamp for a full cure so while you watch me do that i've told you what i'm doing for christmas i'm going to be on some sunny island what are your plans have you got family coming to you are you going to your family or are you gonna have a nice quiet christmas in with your loved one leave me a comment below let me know so once i've done that i add a little bit of white to that red gel paint and then that makes it you know a lighter red a darker pink if you will and what i'm going to do is i didn't like that take it away this is why we cure in between it's all fully cured at this stage because i have used bulk of color so what i'm going to do is do an oval at the top of that bow so it looks like the material is folded around and then i'm going to outline that middle section as well fully cure that in the lamp and then i'm going to put a layer of base coat over that and into that wet base coat i'm going to pop some four pointer stars i will then fully cure that in the lamp and then give it a generous top coat once that's fully cured then we are at the end of our nail play today so i hope you've enjoyed day 18 of our nail art christmas if you have would you mind taking a moment and hitting that thumbs up and if you're not subscribed already i would love it if you would bye